I'm Dr. Dave Harris, and I want to welcome you to this series of videos on video and television production. We're talking about video switchers and specifically about Luma Key today in this video. A Luma Key is a very simple graphic to key into the switcher mix. We are going to go to the effects key menu, select key one or key two, and then push that Luma Key button. It's useful when we've got graphics that have black or white backgrounds. The background gets keyed out based on the luminance of the graphic. In other words, if it's dark, has very little luminance, or if it's very, very bright, meaning it has lots of luminance, we can use the Luma Key to key out those very, very bright areas or very, very dark areas, depending on how we've set up the graphic. We also call this a self key because it only requires just the fill graphic, just the one graphic. It doesn't require a separate key channel, which would be the case in things like a linear key. To set up a Luma key, we've only got just a couple of dials and a couple of settings that need to be used. We've got the clip and the gain dials. What this is going to do is this is going to allow us to clip out either the brightest or the darkest areas of the image and then use the gain control on the foreground, meaning the graphic itself, to either increase or decrease the luminance of the graphic before it gets keyed. Also, we've got the inverse button, which would be pushing this button because it's labeled inverse. That would be if we're trying to do, rather than the lightest areas or brightest areas of the image, we're trying to do the darkest areas of the image or the blackest areas of the image. We also have the pre-molt button, which we'd push here. This is going to be if we have exported this graphic out of a software program like Photoshop, which pre-multiplies the uh, alpha information as part of the graphic. Now, if this is a lot for you to handle, we do have other videos that do describe what an alpha channel is and how alpha channels are part of things like Photoshop. Lastly, we have the fly key button. This is if this particular Luma key graphic is going to be part of a DVE or digital video effect. This video is part of a series of videos on television production. If you want more information, more videos, go to our channel, find playlists and other things. Do subscribe if you want to see more videos and consider visiting Patreon and becoming a donor or patron for the videos that are a part of this channel. I do thank you for your support. I am Dr. Dave Harris.